Hey Leo. This is going to be a general for the rest of April. If you have Leo anywhere in your chart, this reading is for you. Cross watchers are welcome. If this video does not resonate, please check your other placements. Okay, look at the videos for those zodiac signs as well. All right, remember that roles can be reversed. So let's see what the overall energy is for you guys. Leo, ooh, you making choices that are actually fulfilling you. Okay, you're not settling for less. If it doesn't, if you know that it's not gonna fulfill you, then you're not gonna you're not gonna do it. And that's the beauty in it. That's the beauty in all of it. Okay, you're having the strength. Okay, this is fulfilling you, standing in your energy, making proper choices. Okay. You've settled too much in the past to continue to settle in the present and for the future. So you're being you're staying obedient to what it is that you want, okay? Yeah, you're like, no, that cycle of me feeling invisible is over, okay? You guys are, are praying, praying a lot more. Now, let's see what your divine ener divine feminine energy is. Okay, you guys know what sets you off. You're learning to heal from those things. So no one won't, so anyone coming in your path or um, that you're coming, that you're, you're meeting, that is for your higher purpose. So they won't get that wrath, okay? You're recognizing your triggers and you're working on those, okay? You're understanding that you're made up of a lot of different, a lot of different things, okay? You have a lot of different layers, okay? Healing your self-worth understanding how to attract abundance oh yes okay so your divine feminine energy is i am an embodiment of love i am tra attracting my money okay so y'all attracting the person that y'all get y'all people attracted to y'all right now okay and y'all attracting some of y'all a lot of y'all are attracting the right the right people okay especially for the women you're attracting the right person because this is a divine, divine feminine energy but we all have divine feminine and divine masculine so let's see what um your divine masculine energy looking okay yeah your gifts are expanding rapidly as well okay let's see what your divine um masculine energy is you're understanding that you are love okay and you have to embody that to receive it okay Somebody is looking at you like you are the one. I know you are the one. And we can go ahead and move forward with this. Okay. I was in denial. Okay. So you guys could have been in denial about you being an embodiment of love. Okay. But now you're starting to see your toxic patterns. Somebody you're dealing with could be seeing their toxic patterns and they're yearning for you. They want you. They look at you as their queen. Okay. Or king. Okay, you've been holding back from conflict or you hold back from conflict with someone. Okay. Somebody here is looking like it's taking Leo a mighty long time to come towards me. And all the whole while they're invisible to you. All right, so let's get into the tarot. This person is thinking that they... You're going to come back towards them, but you left it. They left you in the cold. Justice don't don't work that way, baby. Not with somebody who sees themselves as an embodiment of love. Leo was like, yeah, I'm getting I'm going after what's mine and what's fair and what's just. OK. OK, so you guys have been working, putting in the work. This is why your gifts are expanding rapidly. Things are coming in, rushing in fast for you, okay? Because you're doing the work. All right, you have the key. A lot of you guys are finding the key, okay? Finding the resources within, staying committed to doing so, and you're receiving abundance, all right? All right, 
you're allowing yourself to be free from the betrayals um, from your past. See, you're standing there letting everything kind of brush off of you, okay? It doesn't matter if people are choosing or if someone is choosing to come and start conflict or stir up conflict with you because you're now committed to a higher path, okay? Your finances are about to be balanced out or they have just gotten balanced out, okay? Things are, you're balancing yourself out, okay? This is why you're starting to look good. You're in the Two of Cups energy with the embodiment of love again here, okay? You're going to have a reason to celebrate soon coming in. You guys are doing very well, okay? That is very good. Now, um, somebody, somebody wants to come in and fight for you, okay? You have come out on top. You have pulled the swords out of your back, out of your chest, because for some of you, this wasn't a backstab. This was a front stab, okay? A chest stab. They they, they stabbed you right in the front, right in your face, okay? Um, you're freeing yourself from that. You're standing up again, um, showing how, that, how you can go forward and still see the light, still be an embodiment of love, okay? Someone definitely was in denial about you, honey. Because this it keeps standing out strong. Yes, you've been working on yourself, Leo. With the Empress coming out on top of that. You've been doing a good job, okay? You're achieving success or success is coming in. Like, success is achieving you. <laughs> Success is coming in. Things are coming in. You're leaving away from feeling left out in the cold or, or or that lack mentality is leaving you. Like you're leaving that in the past. Okay. You've been giving yourself knowledge. You've been putting yourself up on game. You've been staying committed to doing this. Dropping jewels. Dropping gems is what I hear. Okay. Like I said, there is a reason to celebrate coming up. Some of you guys could be getting pregnant or you are pregnant. Okay. You're going to have an addition. A lot of you guys are going to have an addition. You may not be pregnancy, but it's a new addition, okay, to your life or to something that's fulfilling you emotionally. What did I say? You went from the Ten of Swords right back to the Ace of Swords because that Ten of Swords did not stop you and it did not keep you stuck or bound or down, okay? Not for long. You achieved success. And this is true success with the world and the Ace of Swords. This is real success. This is true achievement. Whatever you did, you stay committed and it's going to take off for you. Okay. Somebody here that had you as an option or they kept you as an option is wanting to come in and give you an apology because they see you taking on a new leaf. Okay. Yeah, but they're nothing but a knight of wands that cause conflict for you. They can only watch you from the sidelines all right because they didn't make a decision on you and now you've surpassed them you've um leveled up on them as they would say leo you guys are doing very well in the last few readings i've been seeing that your energy has been good okay you're breaking free a lot of y'all are breaking free from the conflict People are trying to create tower moments for you. You had a you had a realization. You had a lot of realizations, okay, about somebody having you in a third party situation, okay, trying to play you, trying to work on you, and you overcame the situation. You came out on top, okay. Okay, you're having happiness with somebody that is strong. Okay, somebody here is strong. Or they feel strongly about you. They're taking an the offer towards you. It could be slow, but it's definitely true. Okay, or this could be you towards this person. What did I say? You're achieving success with somebody that's coming in and fighting for you because they know this is going they know something is gonna work. They see your worth or they see you as the Empress, they've had a realization, or they keep having realizations on a regular basis. This could also be the person that was in denial. All right, yo, they see you as a ten of pentacles and a three of um 
uh what is this three of wands okay the abundance they see you as abundant so they see you in your true uh power they see you as you are that's who you are and they want to give to you they want to give you a commitment they want to give you a new beginning because you nurture you nur you're nurturing you're caring you help with, with everything that they do or you help them with everything that they do or this is how you are just period okay that this is why they want to come towards you so fast okay somebody here is angry or mad at themselves okay because they lost out somebody feels like they lost out okay somebody is having a win like somebody <laughs> leo you're having a win somebody is watching you somebody is watching you prove them wrong okay so i'm also picking up that somebody was gossiping spreading lies spreading rumors on you about you you're proving the rumors wrong people are seeing this person seeing what this person said and they're like no this is not true about this person they looking at this person like they're a liar all right praise your cups yeah see they want to come in and make an offer towards you now okay they're feeling in despair now them coming back to make an offer towards you after gossiping and telling rumors and secrets um that i mean things that just weren't true they're now wanting to come back towards you but this will put the icing on the cake for those people that they told the lies to they will be looking they, they will look even more foolish okay if they come back towards you but it's about to get out of hand because they see you paired up with somebody or they're going to see you paired up with somebody They're going to come in and try to offer you a stable offer. Yeah. Somebody's going to try to come in and actually like offer you the same thing or offer you something that they think that you want. I don't know why they aren't thinking that maybe you wouldn't want that from them. Okay, you're dealing, somebody here is dealing with somebody more mature. Now, there could be somebody here with one foot in and one foot out because they're still dealing with a karmic situation. Somebody here could be dealing with somebody from their past that they haven't fully let go of, okay? This could be something that you realize too that comes to the surface. And you may tell this person, look you need to get you need to um be done with the past if you want to deal with me because i don't i don't deal with baggage from the past when it comes to moving forward and building it keeping my empire up building my empire i don't do i don't do uh chaos drama things uh that are that are tied to you from your past that are toxic and dysfunctional i will cut you off that's what somebody told this other person they're getting it, they're getting it together or they're straightening themselves up so they can play the role, I mean, be in the role, okay? Yeah, a change may take place here with somebody. Yeah, so this person may come in, they they, they may come in and give the, the correct offer, okay? They're going to come in correct. Yeah, so somebody here could be building a friendship or a courtship. This could be having somebody in despair also. They're like, okay. I was expecting this person to come back, but I see that it's really over. Now I'm going to have to be the one to go in and make the offer when I didn't want to have to do this. And I'm still on my BS. Like, I'm still not even going to come correct. I just don't want this person to get away. Yeah. There could be family involved as well. But somebody here wants the real deal with you. They want the whole package with you. They want marriage, friendship, partnership, family, all of it, okay? 
but somebody could shut something down because someone feels like something comes out about somebody being in the third party or somebody still being in their ego or operating out of ego okay this past person is watching you in another commitment for some of y'all the ones that's in a commitment they're watching you they know it's over with them okay they want to go down a new path with you they may want to start over so they may come to you it's like they want to start over as friends or something like that okay this may be this you may be looking at them like um no <laughs> leo you may be looking at them like uh excuse me you must have me mistaken okay good great fortune okay so yeah that's gonna something is gonna go, gonna go good with you with um a dark skinned person so somebody you could be dealing with a dark skinned male or you could be a dark skinned male dealing with someone okay you're protected with this person this person is protecting protecting you or you feel protected with them you feel excited with them and you feel like you have fun and you feel like this is a spiritual connection okay september could be significant all right you really love this person they really love you they have deep affection okay this is the person the diamond okay this person could be thinking about giving you a ring or something of value all right this could have come out of nowhere okay in february something could have started in february okay something could pop off between august and november okay october could be significant as well okay a change for the better all right okay someone could be leaving away and this could be a change for the better but um someone working against you behind your back okay like i said somebody in your family a family member or um someone you consider family or that you have a child with they could be a rat okay yeah so somebody could come in saying they're passionate about you or whatever because they're in a financial pinch or this um, past person could be in a financial pinch. You are protected from this person. OK, the person that's watching you, they're going to try to come in and make you do something against your will. OK, yeah, because they see you getting um, all types of good luck. Good things happening for you. Leo. Yeah, they're going to be unsuccessful. I knew it. Yeah, they're going to be unsuccessful because your increase in spiritual growth and um, material wealth is going to be so far, like so far above this person. It's going to be a distant memory. Yeah, because it took you a lot of deep personal strength, okay, to make sure that this was successful or to make sure you got your success. You had to go through a lot yeah see wealth you're going down the path of wealth they know this they want to come down that path with you this is why they're a bat okay take care enemies are working against you is because they're an enemy that's why they're in the bat energy okay you're keeping your life in balance you're not taking risk you're having prosperity and abundance coming in there's people doing risky things taking chances doing whatever they're doing trying to get um trying there because they're greedy and, thing, and things like that you don't take that road okay because it's not it's unsuccessful it doesn't work okay yeah you just continue they're gonna come and ask you because you're gaining uh you're gaining things you're getting things okay so they could be in cahoots with somebody that's telling them to go towards you to get get stuff from you and you're not having it you're looking at them so crazy okay because they were my bad y'all because they're working against you. They are. Let's see what your advice is.
Y'all have, y'all are in some beautiful energy right now, Leo. Listening to your intuition and like being positive. That is very beautiful. High priestess, yes, high priestess energy. And that's what a lot of you guys are doing. You're in high priestess mode, which is what it was saying when they were like, your um, gifts are being revealed to you. Or, um, or was it your gifts? Yeah, they're expanding rapidly. It's because you're believing, okay? You're believing in yourself. You're trusting yourself. You're believing in love still, even after, you know, bad situations have taken place in your life, okay? Yes, trusting in the unknown, the sky father, seeing things from a higher perspective, and you're retreating and recharging, okay? You're going, you're, you're going to hermit mode and do self-reflection a lot, okay? This ignites, this gives to your passions, um, the gifts that you have. It helps tie everything together for you, okay? So you go out. All right, you listen to your ancestors as well. You go out. You have, you're protected, baby. Look, if anybody is trying to come in at you, you're protected. This is another reason why you're in such beautiful energy, okay? When you go out and you give out, you give yourself to others, you know, you help others, you go back in, okay? And you look within, too. You go and help yourself. You recharge yourself. You retreat from everything and check yourself, okay, to make sure you're, you're staying in alignment, Leo. This is well. This is, this is great, okay? This is why you're granted wealth, okay, in life, not just externally, but internally. All right, so these were your messages, Leo. If this video resonated with you, please like, share, and subscribe. Let me know down in the comments what's going on with you guys, and I'll talk to you later.